For 14 centuries, St. Elijah's Monastery in Mosul, Iraq, stood for peace and faith, hosting worshipers from around the world. But these newly obtained satellite images confirm the monastery was standing when ISIL militants took over the area in 2014, only to be ground to powder just one month later. There's nothing left. Small piles of rocks, perhaps, but nothing that would look like the monastery. Our Christian history leveled in a barbaric way. Reverend Paul Thabit Habib can hardly believe the monastery in his hometown of Mosul is gone. All the poets, historians and travelers who wrote about this monastery, they described the priests, the atmosphere inside. It became a very important place for the history of the church in Iraq. The destruction is the latest victim of ISIL militants. Last year, ISIL released video showing the destruction of Hatra in Iraq, a UNESCO heritage site from the time of Alexander the Great. In 2014, they featured another attack in Mosul, justifying the attacks as part of protecting their interpretation of Islam. What they don't destroy, they sell, earning income for their so-called caliphate. They're benefiting not only from the sale, but also just from the trade itself. Suzanne Bott helped restore St. Elijah's Monastery when she worked as a U.S. State Department cultural advisor. She says the result is the same, a loss for generations to come. They will never be able to stand in these locations and experience the feeling of looking around and seeing what our ancestors were able to do. Jessica Stone, CCTV, Washington.